I found that it's quite easy to culture green water indoors, Chlorella vulgaris or some other unicellular free floating algae that gives the water a green tint. However, if you add too much fertilizer, such as pulverized osmocote pellets, to the water, although it may be as green as pea soup, the nitrates can get extremely high, so much so that adding that frequently to Daphnia cultures kills the Daphnia. So I've been experimenting with sponge filters and just simple aeration to try to come up with culturing Chlorella vulgaris without so much fertilizer that the nitrates are too high. The green water cultures on the left lost their green hue. It appeared that the Chlorella vulgaris was dying off. However, after sitting those cultures in the backyard with no aeration in the sunlight, they quickly started turning green again. So I started several containers of used aquarium water and seeded them with Chlorella vulgaris in the backyard so that I'll have plenty of green water and I want to be able to continue to culture it indoors. It may get almost clear during winter but hopefully there'll be a few specimens survive during colder months so that I can start it up again next year with sunlight in the warm out of doors.